All right, before we get into Ozempic week four, just a reminder, I am not a medical professional. I am not a doctor, a nurse. I barely can figure out what vitamins to take in the morning. So don't listen to me about medical advice. This is just me giving you my personal advice or personal opinion as someone who's taken this stuff. And uh, all right, let's get into it. My name's Ed. After an alarming visit to the doctor, I decided to take a new path. More travel, more experiences, and share what I learned. Welcome to the Dow of Ed. On the uh, Ozempic front, um, it's going well. I mean, no side effects really. Um, the constipation went away, and um, everything looks like it's going well. I'm losing weight. I, I'm, I spent most of my time in a jungle, as you can see here from uh, Anchor Wat today, and uh, so there's not a lot of scales there. And my uh, hotel doesn't have a, a good scale. It's got like a really cheap one that won't weigh. Amount of proportion. So I'm not going to get my weight today, but I'm going to Bangkok soon uh, to layover and then Singapore. So, and I'm staying in a nice hotel, so one of them will have hopefully a good scale, and I can I can get you some honest truth here on some numbers. Um, so I just uh, I just finished having a pita crocodile pizza. I had to try it, and so I had a couple slices of that. Overall, it's going really well. I think um, uh, I definitely noticed my pants size is going down. I'm, I mean, pants are very loose on me. Um, appetite is, uh, like I, I went to a French restaurant last night and um, food was amazing and I overate a bit and uh, I, I felt it. I, it felt like, I mean, I, when I say overate a bit, I probably have like, you know, maybe two meals for my meal of the day. So probably, you know, maybe 2,500 calories. And man, it felt like I ate like 5,000 calories. I was dying. I couldn't believe I ate that much. I was, and I kept thinking, what the hell did I eat? Because I didn't. I eat that much. I ate, I ate a lot, but not like the way I felt. So that's good. It's going to stop me from eating that much again. I shouldn't eat that much. Um, and uh, yeah, so it's going well. And uh, I will definitely get some numbers for you soon. And um, so yeah. And of course, I am not a uh, medical professional of any kind. So this is just Batman taking Ozempic while he travels Southeast Asia. So that's who I am. So uh, good luck on your weight loss. I should add that I'm going from 0.25 to 0.5 milligrams uh, this evening, so uh, we'll see how that goes. I, I actually was supposed to take it last night, but I didn't want to uh, uh, take it and risk having some sort of uh, new side effect while I'm in the jungle um, with Ancient Ruins playing Tomb Raider. So uh, I actually, um, I'll do that tonight. So going from 0.25 to 0.5, and I'll let you know if there's going to be any uh, any uh, side effects or complications when I when I have it. So I'll let you know that next week. Um, I hear there might be, people will up their dosage, but uh, we'll see. One thing I've been hearing, and I, I do it myself, is shooting in the leg, a lot less chance of complications. Some people say it's less effective, but I don't, I don't know if it's less effective, but it's certainly a lot less complications from everything that I've read online and from my personal experience. Um, and my friend who was having some complications, she shoots in the leg now too, and she's not having any issues. So keep that in mind. <laughs> 